I'll also share with you guys the parts that I received within the rebuild kit from Friday Parts. So let's get right to it. All of this came within the rebuild kit. Over here, we have six brand new valve seals. Uh, these will go onto the valve guides on the cylinder head. We have a valve cover gasket, intake manifold and exhaust manifold gasket that go up against the cylinder head. Now, if you guys have a two part intake manifold uh, or exhaust manifold, this might be the gasket for you. Uh, we have various O-rings for the whole engine rebuild. We also have some nice copper crush washers uh, for certain bolts. We also have two brand new main seals. So this is for the smaller end of the crankshaft. And this is for the side of the flywheel, which is obviously much bigger. And over here, we also have paper gaskets for the engine rebuild. And there's also even the paper gasket for the oil pump. Now this right here is probably the most important gasket you'll need for your engine rebuild. And that is the head gasket. You wanna make sure this head gasket matches your old one and that it fits on your cylinder head and your engine block. You wanna make sure that all the holes line up. These holes right here are for your push rods. Then the bigger holes around the perimeter are for your head bolts. And then we also have some for the cone passageways. And we also have one on the top right for the oil port. You really wanna make sure this head gasket lines up with your cylinder head and engine block, because if you do not, and one of those ports is blocked, you might have coolant issues or you will have oil issues. And that will most likely lead to a failure of your engine. Another part I received from Friday Parts was this used oil pan extension. It had some silicone around the perimeter, but I cleaned it up and this part is perfectly flat and it is in great condition. My old one was cracked and somebody tried to weld it up, but it would probably always leak oil. So I was really in need of a new one and Friday Parts came through with this part and I'm more than happy. So if you guys are looking for reused parts, uh, send them an email and maybe they'll be able to find what you're looking for. On the right side of this table, I have some more parts that came within the engine rebuild kit. As you can see, three brand new pistons, three sets of piston rings and three brand new wrist pins. On the bottom end of the connecting rods, I also received three brand new bearings and I already installed them because I had to measure them to check the specs and they are all within spec. So the quality on these bearings is awesome. Now there's another part I received from Friday Parts, but this does not come within the engine rebuild kit. If you guys are in need of this camshaft bearing, you will have to ask Friday Parts specifically for this part. This part holds the camshaft on the front end and this bearing will be inserted into the engine block. Another part that does not come within the engine rebuild kit is this idler gear bearing. This will be inserted inside of the idler gear. And if you guys are in need of this, you will have to ask Friday Parts specifically for this bearing. 